is Tony with the Laser Agent. Just a quick video to show you how to do a fiber verification or a calibration of your flexible waveguide. This is the hollow waveguide, flexible waveguide, some people call it a wand or a fiber. Um, what you have to do per the operator's manual by the manufacturer is to calibrate this every so often to account for the energy loss coming out of the laser through the end of the tip so that what you uh, dial in on the control panel in watts is actually what is reaching the tissue because you have to account for some loss in here. So let me show you how to do it. Um, go ahead and power up your laser. Let it start up in its normal mode. It generally starts up and, and goes to 2 watts by default. Okay, so now it's ready to go. Make sure that you're on continuous mode, which is this mode with just a single step. You can change that by pushing this, but make sure you're on the single step mode. 2 watts. What you want to do is bump this up to 6 watts. It'll flash. And then once it stops flashing, you can put it into ready. Put it into ready mode. Okay, so now it's ready to fire, ready to calibrate, whatever. So when you calibrate, you use a straight hand piece, either with no tip in it or with the ceramic 0.8 calibration tip. Either one of those will actually work the same. So it's in ready. I'm going to take the fiber or the hand piece. I'm going to stick it into the fiber calibration port. What I do is I push it until it touches and I pull it back just a millimeter or so. And I kind of hold my fingers and keep it centered in that port. With it in ready, I'm going to press and hold the foot pedal down and keep holding it down. And it's going to go through a series of clicks. You know, click five times and then you'll see a check OK on the screen. That's when you know you can let up on the foot pedal. Okay, check OK. I can let up on the foot pedal. And I, at this point, I can go ahead and use the laser or I can put it in standby. Okay, so now I've calibrated the laser to this waveguide. We recommend doing that anytime you get a new waveguide. You should do it regularly to check that. Anytime you get your laser back from service or change anything, you should make sure you calibrate it to your fiber. So if you get a loaner laser from us for service, make sure you take your fiber and put it on the loaner laser and calibrate the laser to your fiber. Or if you get a new laser, go ahead and do this as the first step to calibrate the laser. So now you're ready to go. You can put whatever tip you choose in there and uh, you're ready to use the laser. Thank you very much.